This is the uh, Tac Pack modular belt system. It's fairly new. It's a new product that we're carrying here at Bowers. This one's been set up already. This one's Rob's. As you can see, it's running HSGI tacos, uh, Blue Force gear dump pouch, a Blue Force gear uh, IFAC and tourniquet carrier, a G code belt carrier. We've also used Safari Land products on this. Um, it's set up essentially to use Molly. So if you look at the side of this, what you're doing is you're putting a single molly into the center groove here, and then the molly attachment system is grabbing the two outer pieces. So on the inside of the belt, once it's attached, you can see that all of the molly strips are holding everything very well strong in place, not moving around at all, not coming off. Same thing with the Hypalon, holds just fine. And then here, it also, since this is an inch and three quarters, it gives you the ability to put just a basic belt um, drop down for the holster here. Then you're using Cobra belt buckles, obviously, and they're made at a Condura strap. I think that's what that is. It's definitely Condura on the outside here. So they are extremely strong. They have the internal Velcro reason they have the internal velcro is that the inner belt has the other side of the velcro. It's a nice thin piece that goes on to most belt loops easily and one of the things that we help them design is we help them design an extra loop system on here. So you can see that there's tabs on here and the way that this works is this goes into the tab, locks in place, you tighten it down and then this very short piece velcros back on and it gives you a mechanical stop beyond the Velcro to stop that from slipping potentially. The reason that we use a small piece of, of strap here is because this is essentially dead zone when it comes to the Velcro and we wanted as little, as little dead zone as possible for the Velcro to adhere and control that weight to the maximum capability. The reason it's modular and one of the other things that we helped them do was we helped them develop an inner piece which can be connected to the Velcro on the inside like this. And now you can wear it without the inner belt on the outside if you have a jacket or something like that and you wanna tighten it down and you don't want the belt to slip. So now you basically have a, a neoprene-like material adhered to the inside which can grab onto fabric a lot like the other neoprene belts that are in place now. This gives you the ability to use it in both ways. It comes in flat dark earth, it comes in black, and it also comes in multicam. All three of them are essentially made in medium large and extra large with the two inner belt sizes, a medium and large. These all come in black. Since they're an inner belt, it's not as big a deal if they're just all black. We could probably get one made in FDE special request, but um, I don't see a whole lot of need for that at this point. We haven't had anybody ask. So that's it, that's the attack pack modular belt that we're selling here now. Um, the belts go for $115 and the inner belts go for $45. So the price is right. They're made here locally in the Denver metro area. They're easy for us to get a hold of and do special requests if necessary. But so far, the system that we've helped them set up has been 100%. We haven't had a single problem with any of them.